Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. He's the smooth crooner who reps Rashawn's hometown, Decatur, Georgia. He first came on the music scene with top 20 hits like Get It Shouty and The Bedrock. Well, and Bedrock. After a five year hiatus, he's back with a new album entitled True, which includes hits like this. Oh, oh, we did. Okay. <laughs> Please welcome Lloyd. <laughs> Hello. 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 How you doing? How are you? How are you? Hey, good morning. We were over here jamming this morning. Yes, I we see were. that. I see that. <laughs> yes, we Only were. in ATL. Okay, so let's just get right on into it. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> that makes me yeah. nervous. And it should. <laughs> okay. Because I'm going to tell you something that made me nervous this morning. What's that? Traffic? The album cover. Oh. <laughs> okay. The album cover. What's T? You ain't got no clothes on, no, man. No, no. It's just you and the good time. That's how I came in the world. That's how, what they well, You know, this that's is how true. I came in. But what was the inspiration? <laughs> Look at God, my God. <laughs> what was the inspiration behind that? Well, the inspiration was self-love. Okay, um, okay. That was pretty much the basis of all things, uh, appreciation for this life, for mm -hmm. this body, mm -hmm. um, and also for this beauty. I think that can uh, sometimes be wrongly interpreted, mm -hmm. judged, mm -hmm. misconstrued, overlooked. Mm -hmm. um, uh, it was also just about, you know, representing black love in a lot of ways. Uh, you know, sometimes growing up, I felt that um, the projection of beauty didn't always look like me, okay. mm. you know, so now that I have the platform to express what I think is beautiful, mm -hmm. I thought what better way uh, than to start with myself. Also, as a man, letting go of fear and mm. insecurity, mm -hmm. um, being vulnerable maybe, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, and then the guitar just represents my love, infinite love for music and how mm. it's like this extension of my spirit. So. Oh, wow. Well, it's a beautiful picture. It We're really not is. upset. I'm telling you, I just wanted to know why. <laughs> they wanted me to be his partner on Naked and Afraid. That's yeah. what it was. <laughs> <laughs> But you said something, let me quote you properly. You said, a lot of people are scripted. They're well rehearsed in the sense of being able to hide themselves with gimmicks. Yes. So mm. what would you say is the most authentic part of you as an artist? And what did you mean by the quote? Most authentic part, I think, is that uh, I'm a perfect imperfection mm -hmm. in, in every sense of the word that I embrace, you know, the trials of my life, mm -hmm. that I celebrate losses as lessons mm -hmm. more so than anything else Definitely. and also that I realize um, I guess the value of each person in my life so I carry a lot around a lot of respect for each person I collaborate with um, I'm a father now yes, mm -hmm. so that's just heightened my yes. you know Parenting just my level change, of yes. appreciation mm -hmm. and also the fact that I'm I'm uh, cognizant of all the great ones that have done this before me. Mm -hmm. So every time that I try to record, I at least, you know, try to keep in mind that um, there are some people that sacrificed a lot Absolutely. to have that opportunity. So just putting everything into it, I think, is what makes me true. Now, Laura, you did you had a five-year hiatus, mm -hmm. which I think is necessary for mm -hmm. artists. Yes. You know, because we have to detach. Yes. What was the biggest lesson that you learned in your hiatus? Uh, I learned that love never dies. Mm -hmm. uh, like my love for music, mm -hmm. it, it never really it dies. It never dies. You right? try so hard, but it just, it don't go I learned hard. that the hardest thing to do is to pick up an instrument. Hello, yeah. somebody. That's very difficult. <laughs> One of the hardest things. It really is. takes so much time. Mm -hmm. I've learned uh, how much love goes into each person, no matter how they turn out one day mm -hmm. or the mistakes they may make later in their life. There was someone there in the early stages to give them love mm. nine times out of ten mm. you know so just appreciation for parenting through becoming a father yeah. and I've also learned that words matter you know Definitely the power yes. of vocabulary and um, also sometimes the power of silence you know being away for five years mm -hmm. uh, I was kind of tempted at times to try to ride the, mm -hmm. the waves that was going on mm -hmm. and maybe you know blurt out things on mm -hmm. social media but uh, sometimes being quiet is, is actually more powerful, so. Well, Lloyd, we are having, uh, we, you are amazing. Yes. And we congratulate you on all your success. Thanks. And you can get Lloyd's new album, True, on iTunes and Google Play. And we all know the conversation always continues at Sister Circle TV on all social platforms.